Instacart is changing its pricing experiment policy, and this could have huge implications for data analysts and data scientists across the entire tech industry. So first, Instacart noted that these pricing experiments were randomized trials. They were not doing any sort of price discrimination based on who they think would be more willing to pay. It was purely random chance. But now, if there are two families shopping for the same items at the same time from the same store location, they will always see the same price. But of course, it's that equality which is specifically what makes a random trial so powerful, right? When we see that they are equal on everything else other than the price, this is what allows us to estimate a real clean treatment effect of that price difference to measure the elasticity of that item. So now instead, prices are probably going to vary between the physical store locations and they can still do experiments on a store by store basis. But here's the problem, and this is why this is gonna actually favor senior level data scientists over data analysts and junior data scientists. Data analysts and junior data scientists are generally expected to be able to do user level A-B testing. They can do a power analysis, and then they can do like a simple t-test difference in means to determine if there is a statistically significant increase due to a treatment effect. But now when we're doing market level or store level randomization, we no longer can count on large sample size randomization. Instead, we're dealing with small sample issues. So take a company like Sam's Club, which does sell on Instacart. They may have thousands or tens of thousands of users that are hitting the storefront on Instacart every day, but they actually only have 600 distinct stores across the entire country. So now you have a, effectively a fixed sample size of just 600, and that is going to completely deteriorate your statistical power. And even more than that, when you're randomizing over 600 stores, you're not even necessarily guaranteed or to get anywhere close to stores that are equal on observable characteristics, forget about unobservable characteristics. So we're going to get into a world because of this policy with Instacart ending price experiments. If this has a trickle down effect, this could dramatically increase the demand for senior level data scientists at the expense of data analysts and junior data scientists.